another adventure. We're gonna go over and uh, drive through some more desert and look at McDowell Regional Park. It's supposed to be a pretty place, so we're gonna go check it out. Come on with us. out here is loaded with mountain bike trails and most of them are for competition so that's something that uh, if you're in mountain biking Fort McDowell Regional Park that's your place to come check it out you know the thermometer in the car says it's 111 112 degrees but I'll tell you right now it certainly does feel that hot. I mean it's hot. Whenever you go out it's hot but it just doesn't feel like it would be that that scorching of a hot. So maybe there is something to this dry heat after all. somebody was coming down the hill and I didn't want to 
go walk up there, especially, you know, being as COVID as it is, you know, the virus that won't leave. So I just decided that rather than hiking with a mask on, I will just turn around and go the other way. certainly aren't uh, in the best of condition whenever you get farther back into the park. They're definitely a little uh, rock and rolly. Almost like going down a dirt road or going down a uh, wash or something. They rock you back and forth, up and down. This is paved. <laughs> sunset tonight. It's kind of cloudy, so I'm not really sure what's going to happen. So we'll see what we can get for colors of sunset. get sites that are covered for your uh, travel trailers, motorhomes, and what have you. Very, very nice campground. There's a dump station out here. Uh, looks like all of the ones that are covered are full hookups, water, electricity, uh, all of that stuff. Most of the other ones are just dry camping. Uh, Looks like possibly they're just uh, no amenities, just whatever, just pull in and go. But for the most part, um, it's a very, very nice campground. I'm very impressed. Scottsdale, uh, North Phoenix area. You can get to it off of Highway 87. And uh, it's pretty easy to get to from there. It's McDowell Mountain Regional Park. Go check it out. 